Hey guys, I got a new video for you today, and this is going to be an unboxing of the 1UP box and Loot Crate box for the month of October 2015. I wanted to do both of these together to kind of not bore you with two different videos, um, and specifically because I wanted to con kind of uh, contrast the themes between the two boxes, uh, especially Loot Crate, because if you guys are following my channel, you know that a couple of videos back I did mention that I was not sure if I want to continue to do Loot Crate, uh, specifically because they weren't including a t-shirt in their boxes. And that's kind of how I justified getting the boxes, you know, paying $20, you get a t-shirt plus all the extra items in there. So let's take a look at both of these. We'll start with one up box, move Loot Crate out of the way. The theme for this month of October, 2015 for one up box was nightmare. So I definitely wanted to see what they would throw in there to kind of fit that theme. So let's go ahead and open the box and we'll see what's inside. All right. So right on top, you have a t-shirt, which we'll actually set to the side. We'll leave that for last. And you have quite a few things in there. That's really cool. We'll start with this up here. This looks like a survival bracelet. And uh, if you guys follow the channel, you know that I make my own kind of paracord survival bracelets. But for those of you that don't have any, uh, that's pretty cool that they included this on there. One thing that, they, that I really like that they added is the whistle buckle. So this part of the buckle right here is actually a whistle. And this uh, cordage looks like it might glow in the dark. So with Halloween right around the corner, the fact that you have a glow in the dark bracelet with a um, whistle buckle, again, if it does glow in the dark, is really cool. That's a cool accessory to put on, you know, on yourself or your children or whatever, if they're gonna go out trick or treating, you know, to be able to make noise if they get in trouble or something like that. So that's cool, I'll set that to the side. Uh, let's see, uh, Pop Rocks, all right. These are really, really awesome. This one is cotton candy explosion flavored, so I'll definitely be sharing this with the boys. We'll have some fun with that. Uh, here is the pin for this month. And again, this is one up box, month of October, 2015. Nightmare is the theme. And this actually looks like a, uh, looks like Donatello from the Ninja Turtles, but it looks kind of uh, zombified there. So that's a cool pin. Uh, yeah, I like that. You have a, what is this, an eye mask? Yeah, it's an, it's an eye mask. So, you know, you would put this on if you want to go to sleep and there's too much light or whatever. Uh, but this is actually, um, it's themed with the ghost from the, the Super Mario games. So that's really cool. It's nice. It's white. Normally you see these in black. So I'm not sure how much light that's actually going to block out. But it's really cool that they have that kind of theme on there. So there it is. Uh, you have a couple things here on the bottom. The one all the way on the bottom there is just the card that gives you all the information on the items inside the box. But since we're going through it, I'm not going to go ahead and read that. This looks like a poster. And yeah, it is a poster. Oh, that's really cool. Let's, uh, let's lay this down so you guys can see it. All right. So obviously, one up box nightmare. You have this road uh, kind of leading up to this mountaintop. And you have Sally and Jack from the Nightmare Before Christmas up there. Then uh, what would be the moon is one of those ghosts, kind of similar to the one in the, in the um, eye mask here. And it's symbolizing the moon, but it's the ghost itself. And then right at the bottom of the hill here, you actually have Ecto-1, the uh, car from the Ghostbusters. And then you have Luigi and somebody else kind of walking up there. And you have these ghosts on the side. So that's pretty cool. Uh, you know, maybe we'll put this up in the boys' room if they want. So cool little poster there. And then um, one thing that I did want to note is that uh, both Loot Crate and 1UP Box that I have been doing for quite some time, I've actually never received a pop figure. Uh, I think I started Loot Crate after they stopped sending pop figures. And the this is actually my second 1UP Box. There wasn't one in the last one. So uh, this is pretty cool that it has actually two of them. They're a little bit smaller, but it's still cool. So this is a Pocket Pop keychain. So this is actually a keychain of Jack Skellington. So um, really nice styling on it. I'm not going to open these because I'm, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them. If I'm going to you know put them up on display or have the boys play with them. And if that's the case, then I'll have them open them. But there it is. That is the, the box. So this is Jack Skellington. And then this one is really cool. If you guys are fans of The Walking Dead, this is Daryl Dixon from The Walking Dead. I'm a big fan. So, um, you know, the fact that I got this one is really nice. Again, really awesome styling. It looks just like him. Again, this is the Pocket Pop keychain. So, all the way around. So, there it is. So, that's really cool. They definitely did include some really awesome stuff in there. And, obviously, we have not 
seen the shirt yet. So let's go ahead and take a look at the t-shirt. This is a black t-shirt. I'll open it up and lay it down so you guys can see the print on there, the artwork on it. And there it is. Uh, I really do like the contrast between this purple and the black. It looks really, really cool. So you've got Luigi here with his vacuum kind of walking through this cemetery. Um, and, you know, they did include a lot of uh, really awesome stuff. Same way that they did in last month's shirt. Uh, I think they, they're pretty good at you know meshing all the different characters into the, the you know the design of the shirt so obviously in the moon back here you have oogie boogie from the nightmare before christmas some of these ghosts uh let's see what i see here you have uh, mario's hat a kind of looks like a busted up turtle shell here uh this looks like link's sword and then this is the trap from the ghostbusters that's really cool and then a busted up uh star there and then a the crown so really really awesome and you have these uh kind of gates and then the bats walk, you know, flying around. So a really cool shirt. I do like that. So again, in my opinion, I think uh, one up box definitely hit it out of the park once again this month with their uh, pretty much everything that they included in there, the pops, the um, poster, the eye mask, uh, even the, um, the, the survival bracelet. The pin is really cool this month. Also the pop rocks, you know, everything is uh, it's awesome. So there it is. That's the uh, one-up box for this month. Let's take a look at the Loot Crate now. Put this to the side. Open up Loot Crate again. Um, the reason that I kept Loot Crate for this month is because I did get wind that they were going to be including two things, both a shirt and the pop. So since I didn't have any pops, uh, you know, I'm, I wanted to do that. And I wanted to see what they were going to do as far as the shirt went. Also, um, as far as the theme goes, the theme is time for this month. They were going to include certain things that was going to be uh, Back to the Future. It was going to be Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure and uh, Doctor Who. Now, um, Back to the Future and Bill and Ted's, I love the films. I'm pretty familiar with those. Don't know anything about uh, Doctor Who. Never really seen the show or anything like that. So, you know, it is, uh, it's going to be a surprise for me. So let's go ahead and open this one. Here it is. Uh, wow, right off the bat, you can obviously see here is the pop. So this is uh, Back to the Future pop, and it is a Loot Crate exclusive. So that's really cool. You can't go to the store and buy these. You can only get them through Loot Crate. And this is obviously Dr. Emmett Brown. Really awesome stylings on there. He's got those goggles on, and then he has, uh, looks like uh, two jumper cables with some electricity uh, kind of flowing in the middle of there. So that's really cool for my first kind of full-size pop, you know, to get this one. And then again, it is a Loot Crate exclusive. And then in the back here, you have uh, two other ones. So you have Dr. Emmett Brown and Marty McFly. This one is obviously, he's got the lab coat and the goggles are on his head and stuff like that. Now, um, I'm not sure if these are already available. I think they are because of the numbers. This is number 49 and this is number 50. And this is 236. So maybe if you have those two, then this one, if you do Loot Crate, then, you know, it'll be part of the collection. So that's really cool so there it is again i'm not going to open it uh, we'll see what we do with that but we'll set it off to the side set the t-shirt off to the side as well we'll look at that last let's see we have the pin here for the month and again this is loot crate october 2015 the theme is time and you have uh, the flux capacitor there and then it says we love you in the middle there that's cool I don't know if you guys can make it out there. So a really cool pin on this one too. I think um, the pins for both one up box and Loot Crate are really good this month. So there it is. Uh, let's see. You have the magazine. I'm trying to keep the bigger things for last. Here is the Loot Crate magazine. Again, theme is time. And it feels, I think it feels kind of hard in here. Okay, cool. So this is a little pullout. This is obviously the license plate for the DeLorean and um, Back to the Future movies. So, out of time. And this is that quote that Dr. Brown says, where we're going, we don't need roads. So that's pretty cool. You can pull that out if you want to and then, um, you know, put it up or whatever. So, so that. Okay, this one is calling my name because of the artwork on the box here. So Back to the Future 2 or Part 2 hoverboard one to five scale replica so if you guys are familiar with the film you know that this is the pattern of the hoverboard that marty mcfly uses and oh this is also a loot crate exclusive so let's see the pop and the hoverboard replica are both loot crate exclusives so that's really cool um they definitely put some thought into what they wanted to include in the box this month let's see if i can get into this 
without breaking the box. There we go. Okay, there we go. So the top comes off, and you have uh, looks like a certificate of authenticity. So that's pretty cool. And so you take that off. There it is. Wow, that is really cool. So there's the hoverboard. Um, really awesome styling. The artwork is really nice on that. Let's see if we can take that out so you can get a closer look. All right, so it is sitting on this base, which has a kind of mirrored bottom to it. And then these two acrylic um, tabs that it's sitting on top. So it kind of looks like it's hovering. So that's really cool. This would definitely look really nice, like on a on a desk, you know, somebody's office desk or uh, like a bookshelf or something like that, you know, especially if you're really into Back to the Future and stuff like that. Even underneath, you have the, you know, the stylings of the uh, the board itself. So that's cool. All right. Set that to the side here. And then last thing in here is, uh, okay, so this is BBC Doctor Who Sonic Spork. So, and then also a Loot Crate exclusive. All right, so... The pop, the uh, hoverboard, and the spork are all Loot Crate exclusive items. So that's really cool. You, that means you, you cannot get these unless you actually get Loot Crate. So that's really nice. So again, I don't know anything much about Doctor Who. So let's take a look at what this is. And okay, it is, uh, it's a spork. <laughs> Basically, it's a spoon with the ends of a fork. If you guys don't know what a spork is, that's what it is. And then it has this... Uh, handle on it which i'm assuming resembles something that doctor who uses in, in the show or whatnot so feels pretty sturdy um i almost would not want to use this you know just on a daily basis you know, unless i was a huge fan then obviously this is what i would you know definitely grab first but uh since i'm not i actually know someone that is a huge doctor who fan so this might actually make it their way um you know contact them and see if they want it why would you not want it but again there it is that is the doctor who sonic spork and again the loot crate exclusive and let's take a look at the t-shirt i can tell you right off the bat it is a really awesome material i really like these uh kind of thinner material shirts i really like the color also this uh it's kind of like a, uh, a royal blue color and obviously this is where they included the bill and ted's excellent adventure you have Bill and Ted there. It says, be excellent to each other. Bill and Ted's excellent adventure underneath there. In the darker print. Really awesome. Again, uh, Loot Crate uh, has a Loot Crate tag there. Uh, I think this is going to be a really comfortable shirt to wear. The only thing is, I really wish they would have probably done a little bit more color on this. Just kind of make it pop a little more. But again, it's a, it's a really cool shirt. And I did want to show you guys the inside of the box. Because, uh, as always, they do include... Uh, some artwork inside the inside of the box. So there it is. This is the um, it's, a, it's a Bill and Ted themed artwork. So you have Bill and Ted there with Lincoln in the middle, and some of the other um, figures throughout history that they brought back, um, you know, to to help them with their project. So if you guys don't know the movie, you know what I'm talking about. And then also the time machine, which is the telephone booth there. So that's really really cool. I can definitely see, um, you know, maybe just leaving this up as uh, you know to display different things. So that's really cool. So just to recap, we'll go ahead and throw the magazine back in there then you have your um, hoverboard one to five scale the sonic sport from doctor who the pin obviously really cool pin and then the emmett brown dr emmett brown pop and then the shirt itself the bill and ted excellent adventure shirt which feels really awesome i'm definitely gonna wear this very soon so that's it that's both um the loot crate and the one-up box for the month of October 2015. The theme for Loot Crate was Time. The theme for one-up box was Nightmare. I think both um, both boxes are really awesome this month. I'm definitely very happy with both of them. And I think for the most part, anybody that's uh, actually doing either one of these two is definitely going to be very happy with these boxes. Uh, Loot Crate, for sure, I can tell you they definitely listened to their customers because I know a lot of people were complaining about the shirt and you know just the lack of substance that the boxes had and I think this one they definitely uh, redeemed themselves so um, you know we'll have to see for the next following months one up I think uh, one up box definitely kept going with their um, quality everything in there you got a lot of stuff the stuff was uh, pretty good quality stuff and the shirt is really nice too so there it is uh, this is the unboxing of these two boxes let me know if you guys have any questions thanks